Alrighty, so uh, I want to give you a quick little design tip actually real quick. Um, so I'm going to head on over to uh, Zozo's design system file on Figma. Head on over to the website. I have the website designed here, right? Uh, what I found really cool, and I'm going to go ahead and start a new file. So let's uh, call this uh, design tip. So we have a new file here on Figma, right? But watch how cool this is. So if I go in here and I head on over to communities, plugins, and find more plugins, let's do framer, right? Framer, copy and paste. Install this, okay? So I'm gonna run it and select a layer. So I'm actually going to select this layer here which contains not the background stuff but this column I'm gonna go ahead and uh, run framer so it's copying these right copy 211 layers so I'm gonna head on over to framer here and then I'm just gonna paste allow <laughs> look isn't this crazy I mean, look. This is exactly like my design. So, drop this right in there. So this is, isn't this kind of insane? Like, this is accurate. Like, usually when you do copy and paste stuff, it's not accurate. This is accurate. This is exactly how I have it in, in Figma. So I wanted to share that with you because I went ahead and created this website for Zozo in an hour or so, two hours. Um, we got this interactive from Spline, thanks to Spline, we got Spline over here. And what we can do is scroll down and this is the website pretty much explaining how it works, connect with us, FAQs. Um, Keep it simple, didn't have much time, just wanted something up so that people can, you know, learn how to use Zozo and then um, download it. Uh, it's not available yet, but excited, man. Really, really excited.